This is code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals. Let's see what we have here. Now I just want to make honey. Some of these clouds might have honeycomb under them. Be sure to check if honeycomb is hiding behind each cloud. If there is honeycomb, the bee will only need to make honey once. Ah, this is similar to what we were doing earlier on in this lesson. So I'm going to want to, I'm just going to start throwing code down. Move forward. Move forward. Then what? Well, I want to know if there's honeycomb. Right, because we're not sure. So I'm going to ask the computer, hey computer, is there honeycomb under me? If so, what do I want to do? Make, that make honey, right? Make honey. So let's start off with that. Perfect. So now what? Well, now I'm going to want to turn to the left. And then what? Well, I'll need to move forward. And then I'm going to move forward again. But now I'm over on blocks. But let's just see what I would want to do. That would put me here. Well, once again, I'm going to want to ask if there's honeycomb, and then I'm going to make honey. The reason I'm asking if there's honeycomb, because if I don't do that, I'll automatically, if I just do this, I'll move forward and start making honey. And if there's no honeycomb there, it breaks the computer. The computer says, air, no, ouch. So instead, I say, if honeycomb. So this will be, I'll move forward, and I'm asking the computer, hey, computer, is there honeycomb under the bee? And the computer says, yes or no true or false so if the computer says yep true there's honeycomb here then it will run make honey i'll make honey if it's false nope no honeycomb it just skips over the make honey line and keeps going which is great because then we don't get an error so this is too much code though i'm at 10 blocks but if i take a look at this you'll notice that this is identical right? And there's never a reason to make code identical, right? So, and I can even add a turn left onto this one because it doesn't matter. I can turn left at the end. There's never a reason to repeat code like this. Be lazy. Let me get rid of that. I'm going to use a repeat block. I want to repeat it twice. I want to do all of that twice, drop in my code, and quapow, hopefully. But, uh, awesome. Let's keep going.